Hello boys and girls, welcome to episode 2 of Interactive Sport. We're going to have a lot of fun, we're going to do some exercises and we're going to go on a little adventure today. So as you can see, I'm standing in front of a map of the world and on this map there are 7 wonders of the natural world and we're going to visit every one of them and do a few exercises while we're there. Sound good? Let's give it a go. So all I need you to do is jog on the spot and I'm going to magically take us to our first wonder. Let's see where we go. And jog it on the spot in three, two, one. Here we are at the bottom of Mount Everest. This mountain is 8,848 meters high and it's been here for over 60 million years. Now our exercises here are gonna be ski jumps and mountain climbers. So ski jumps work a wee bit like this. You're going to find a space on the floor and pretend you're skiing and jump from side to side. Let's try that in three, two, one, off we go. And rest. And our second exercise is going to be our mountain climbers. I want you to place your hands on the surface and your legs out behind you and you're just going to bring your knees up into your chest alternately. Three, two, one, off we go. And rest. And now we're off to our next place. So can everybody just do a big spin on the floor and take us to our next place, which is... Wow! It's the Grand Canyon. Amazing. This place stretches for 277 miles and the gap between the sides is an average of 10 miles the whole way along. That is unbelievable. Our exercises here are going to be star jumps and burpees. So for star jumps, it's the easy one. Star jumps, you just put your hands to your side and we're jumping from them out and in, in three, two, one. Okay, and the burpees is a little more difficult, so I'm gonna do it side on just to show you. I want you to put your hands on the floor, your legs go out, your legs go in, and you stretch up high and jump into the sky. We're gonna try that in three, two, one. And relax. Boys and girls, you have done brilliantly there. I'm just glad I didn't fall off the edge. Let's get somewhere else and have a look at some another natural wonder. Are we all ready for the big spin? Three, two, one. Wow! Rio de Janeiro. The harbour at Rio de Janeiro is one of the natural wonders of the world. Did you know Christ the Redeemer, the statue, was actually elected as one of the new wonders of the world? But we, may, we might learn about that in a later episode. But we've got to do our exercises here. The exercises here are going to be squats and lunges. So here's how we do a squat. I want you to place your hands together in front of you. Let's pretend there's a seat behind you and we're just going to sit down and get up again and repeat. So it's just down and up in three, two, one. And relax, give your legs a wee shake. And the next one is our lunges. So you stand with your hands on your hips and we're going to step forward and let our knees almost touch the floor and back up 
and then the opposite leg goes down and up again. In three, two, one. Break a sweat now. Let's move on to our next wonder. Are we ready for the spin? In three, two, one. Wow, the northern lights. What a beautiful sight. They say they can see the northern lights from space. Amazing. The two exercises we're going to do underneath the northern lights are cross toe touch and high knees. So let's do cross toe touch first. Very simple. You raise one right hand and stretch it down to your left toe. Your left hand stretches to your right toe. Okay, in three, two, one. And relax. Well done, boys and girls. And the next one, high knee. So just raise your hands out in front of your body. And we're going to get up onto our tippy toes and bounce our knees up to hit our palm of our hands. In three, two, one. And rest. Super job, everyone. Now, Let's get ready to do our magic spin and arrive at our next destination. Three, two, one. Wow, Victoria Falls, one of the most beautiful things I have ever seen. Did you know at nighttime, Victoria Falls has what's called a moon bit bow, which is a bit like a rainbow, only it's in the evening. It would be beautiful to see. So at Victoria Falls, we're going to do some side leg raises and we're going to do some butterfly kicks. So let's do the side leg raises first. I want you to lie down on your side. And we're simply going to put our hand on our leg, lift it high and lift it low again. In three, two, one, one. And if you could stop there and turn to the other leg, and same again. Three, two, one. And now we're going to try our butterfly kicks. So if you can lie on your back, and it's just one leg at a time, kick it in the air and swap to the other leg. Three, two, one. Rest. Well done everybody. Let's move on to our next wonder. Let's do our magic spin and head off to see something amazing. Everybody ready? Three, two, one. Wow, it's a parasuiting volcano. This place is amazing. In 1943, this place erupted for eight years. But fortunately that's not going to happen again or I wouldn't be standing here. As we stand in front of this amazing volcano, we're going to do some step jacks and some circle jumps. So starting off with our step jacks, here's what we do. We stand in the spot, we're going to step to the side and bring it in again. To the side and bring it in again. So out and in. Okay, in three, two, one. Stop it there. And our next one is the circle jumps. And what we're going to do is we're going to jump forward, back, side, and side. Everybody ready? In three, two, one, and forward. Back. 
and relax. Boys and girls, we are almost finished this amazing journey, but we have one more place to go and see. Shall we check it out? Let's do it. Magic spin in three, two, one. And our final destination, it's the Great Barrier Reef. What an amazing place. The Great Barrier Reef is the world's largest coral reef and it's just off the coast of Australia in the Southern Hemisphere. So this is our final place, our seventh natural wonder. And what we're gonna do is two exercises, an arm stretch and everybody's favorite, we're gonna finish off with press ups. So first of all, an arm stretch. All I want you to do is put one hand on your hip and the other hand stretched as far as you can to the side and we're going to swap it and do it the other way. Ready? In three, two, one. And our final exercise, and it's our press-ups. So can you all get into the press-up position, which is on the floor, hands just shoulder width apart, and your legs out either on your knees or out nice and straight behind you. And three, two, one. And relax. That is us finished. We need to head back to headquarters and finish up. That has been brilliant, boys and girls. Give yourselves a pat on the back. You have been fantastic. Last magic spin in three, two, one. Whoa, what an adventure. I have had so much fun. I've learned something and I'm feeling a wee bit more energetic now after all the exercises. Thank you for coming on that amazing adventure with me. Make sure you subscribe to our wee channel, Active Sport Kids, and keep an eye out for new videos. Watch all the rest of our other videos and make sure to stay active, keep smiling, over and out.